So I'm getting something about a taste of their own medicine. They could dish it out, but they couldn't take it. Whoever I'm talking about, there's someone here who is afraid of your power. They're afraid of your knowledge. They're afraid of your gifts. And they refuse to believe in you, in your skills, or whatever you're saying. But it's only because of their own fear and their own personal prejudice. They're very narrow-minded is what I'm getting. And for some reason, it's okay for them to dish out hatred, and it's okay for them to dish out negativity, and it's okay for them to say what's on their mind and say what they're feeling and thinking, but it's not okay for you to say it back to them. It's not okay for them to receive their own medicine. So let the universe do that, because the universe is definitely dishing out some kind of medicine at this time. All right. I'm hearing if you can't handle the heat, get out of the kitchen. And that's what these people are being told. I'm getting that somebody, yeah, the devil... That makes a lot of sense to me. You could be a Capricorn. You don't have to be, of course, but this person who was like sending you this negative energy was a Capricorn. But it looks like you're putting an ending to your own suffering. It looks like you're putting an ending to your own um, toxicity, your own negativity. You've put an end to that. And I'm hearing that you're rising above. I'm getting something about the cream rising to the top. You are the cream of the crop. I'm also getting that some kind of like spell or curse has been lifted or has been broken. You did this. You broke the curse or you broke the spell. For some of you, there was a spell on your love life. Somebody was trying to, like, block you from having love. Someone was trying to block you from having finances. Somebody was trying to block you from having a home, from having a family. But that spell is broken. You've broken that spell or that spell is being broken as we speak. That's what I'm getting. But I'm getting that the universe is going to give these people a test of their, a taste of their own medicine because they thought that they could dish it out. But what happens when they have to receive it? And the universe is kind of asking you to get out of the way. With this new moon in Pisces, it's giving you a new perspective that you don't always have to fight your own battles is kind of what I'm getting and that you can kind of just let things go and let things end. Yeah, I just keep channeling something about a timeline shift. So I feel like some of you guys may be doing visualizations, meditations, quantum jumps, um, big manifestations around this time, which is going to be really good for you because you truly believe in what it is that you are manifesting and you truly believe in what it is that you are doing. You're going to change a lot of people's minds is what I'm getting. And I'm getting that a lot of people are going to be attracted to you in the future because they want to learn how to change their life the way that you are changing your life. You're going to inspire a lot of people. You're going to give people a lot of courage and strength. And you're going to show people how to like heal their own wounds is what I'm getting. There's something about like the ego and these people's inner demons like coming through right now. And they're screaming, they're barking, but I'm hearing dogs bark. So whatever that means to you. I just am getting something about the universe delivering karma at this time. So get out of the way. Do what you're doing. Live your best life. <laughs>